Hi traders, Tuesday morning, my second trading day of the week and uh, here are my main candidates, always looking for big movers like NVTA is down 6%, Hertz here on the right down 7%, WB here on the left down 9% and CTRP up 13%. Um, I'm always looking for the opposite side move. Now look at CTRP. It's the first one that came down and now trying to move higher. I'm going to go long, not over the highs, but actually over $40. So here comes the 40 whole number, just touched it. If it's going to come back to the 40 again, I'm going to buy 4,000 shares now. Well, a bit below, I was thinking it's probably going to go up, but it did not. I'm taking a bit of a risk, maybe a pullback here. I hope not. I always look for a stock either to gap up or to gap down dramatically now this one's up 14 percent and i'm always looking for the opposite side move i want to see the sellers coming out of the game it's exact opposite of what i do for the uh for the short side and here we go we're over 14 i'm looking for 40 cents look at the buyers look at the buyers over 40 now over 40 taking my partial at 40 got my 40 cent partial and again a stock that started with a very big gap up tried to move lower failed and moved back over the highs same story with WB you have seen it earlier it was one of my four main candidates today and if it's going to come down under 67 I think it's probably going to continue down. Stock's down 7%. Try to move higher. As you can see here, failed. Stop is going to be approximately 70 cents. Big stop. Short now. Short now. 867. I was expecting it to come down under 67. It did not. Now it did. Good. 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 Look at uh, CTRP. Took my partial earlier at CTRP, but it's coming back up now. I'm going to go long 1,000 shares at 39.90 I want to see it coming back up a little bit now it's the same idea stock that is up 14 percent very likely to continue higher tried to move down again failed look at all of these bottoming tails and very very likely to continue higher I'm a bit cautious here so I've just added 1000 shares I don't want to ruin a good trade whenever I have a trade I don't want to ruin it by taking too much size so just 1000 shares NVTA, same story. Stock is down 6%. Tried to move higher, failed. Initially, it did not give me a chance to move in here. See, it just came down very strong. Again, it was one of my four candidates. But now, if it's going to move under 19, I'm interested because it failed to move higher. And the buyers already came into the game. Now, it just moved under 19. Now, short. Okay, I'm short 4,000 shares. NVTA, hope for some more continuation. WB is finally making its way down and I think I want to add once it comes down under 66.55 approximately look at the seller side more sellers and buyers and it consolidated for a while here now now it's coming down now look at the seller size at 56 plenty of sellers not a lot of buyers CTRP is looking great, added earlier, but now after consolidation, it looks like it may go over 40 once more, where I would like to add again 1,000 shares. Notice, come on, come on, baby, 40, now 40, look at the sell side, now it's over, click the button, took another 1,000 shares long. Now remember, my initial trade was with 4,000 shares. I don't want to risk my profits. So added 1,000 shares earlier when I thought it may move higher. As you can see, it consolidated for a while. It was a little bit disappointing, but now it certainly made a decision to move over 40, so I added one small 1,000 shares only. NVTA did reach my target, as you can see here. Look at this spike down, but I was too busy with WB and I missed it. And maybe that happened too quickly, I'm not sure. I was looking for 30 cents. I was looking to see it under 1817. Look at the seller side, they are now at 75, so it is getting rather close. I may get my second chance here. I'm getting ready to take my partial at 3,600 shares. And yes, 69 buyers, 68 buyers, good. Can it continue 67? Mm, pull back. I want to make sure I'm on the green side. Took my partial. Rather small winner in NVTA. It's quite disappointing, but it is moving down. It's trending lower. The stock is down 7%. It should probably continue down, but 
I was making sure I'm green. MNST, I'm a bit concerned about this one, uh, but I will take it for the short side because the market is now coming down very strong. So I want to short MNST, although it's not going to be my regular size. So I'm down to 2,000 shares short. We'll be short here at 6360. I'm short 2,000 shares MNST. Now I'm a bit worried because maybe MNST is trending higher. Look at that. Most of the last 30 minutes or so, it was trending higher, but the market's coming down now strong and, well, MNST may go with the market. It did not. It did not. Came down like 15 cents, pulled back up. There was a nice, no, it's over now. It's over. Look at this spike over the recent high. That's not going to do well. I should be moving out. I'm out. Okay. Took my loss uh, almost 30 cents, a bit less than 30 cents. I kind of knew that uh, I may be taking a risk here. I thought that this could be a good risk rewards kind of trade, but turned out it continued its trade. I'm out. I have a loser. WB is finally at my target. Just reached my target. 62.20. I added earlier 2,000 shares, so I'm short 6,000 shares. I'm going to take a partial here. At any pullback now. Took my partial. Finally, WB moved. Actually left 1,400 shares. No, I'm going to reduce this. Reducing. Left just 1,000 shares. Hope it's going to continue. It looks fine. Finally took my partial in WB. That lasted for a long, long time. And CTRP just moved over the highs back to the highs, did not yet go through the highs. As usual, it will found some, hmm, some resistance here. I'm going to take my partial here. Taking now. want to make sure I'm on the green side. Okay, added, um, as you remember, 1,000 shares at 39.90 and then over 40, another 1,000 shares. And that's my, actually, third trade or so in CTRP today. Initial trade was the beginning of the trading day and then Two consecutive trades, adding as it returned to the highs and continued scaling into a winner. ADMX, ADMS looks fine. The stock is down 31%. Look at this reversal point under 825. Lots of sellers at 826. Look at the seller side. Less buyers at 85. Nice reversal if you watch the intraday. Now just came down under 85. A bit concerned that it may not be a big mover. It was a big mover today, but volume is not that great now. ADMS is not going anywhere. I mean, it is down. I'm up like 10 cents. I'm going to take my partial right here. Now, actually moved out. Moved out of my old 2,000 shares. So, took a very small profit in ADMS. I'm having, having a great trading day today. Uh, ADMS, a very small winner. CTRP, one loser today in N M M NST. Actually had several winners in CTRP. NVTA, small winner. WB, after adding a very nice winner, but it did not continue my way. CTRP was really nice. And uh, WB, because I added, was my best trade today. So I'm up $4,800, just one hour into the trading day. And I want to thank you very much for watching this video. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Just click right here on the bottom corner and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. And again, thank you very much for watching this video. Thank you for watching this video. Before you go, we invite you to take Traders free trading challenge. If you succeed, you will receive free trading education and access to a $14,000 funded trading account that will allow you to trade from home and keep 70% of your profits. Click here to sign up for this no risk, no cost offer. If you like this video, please subscribe to our YouTube channel where you can view many more stock trading videos. Questions or comments, please submit them below.